Hi, hello, and welcome to yet another episode of Fit India Quiz 2023, India's largest sports quiz brought to you by Ministry of Youth Affairs and Sports. This is your host Surya, and today we go to the head of India, a paradise we all know as Jammu and Kashmir. Welcome to Jammu and Kashmir, a region of breathtaking beauty and deep heritage. Set in the heart of the Himalayas, here age-old traditions are brought to life by skilled artisans whose creations decorate homes and markets globally. Beneath towering mountains, Sufism and Hinduism merge, nurturing a spiritual and a devoted community. Pilgrims seek peace and enlightenment at sacred sites like Amarnath Cave and Hazrat Bal. The inhabitants of Jammu and Kashmir have made a lasting impact on the global stage with their contributions to arts, literature, and scholarly pursuits, inspiring future generations. Beyond tradition and intellect, there is a vibrant spirit of competition and joy in sports. The region is the birthplace of ske, a traditional martial art that includes combat with swords and shields. Sports such as hockey, rugby, and golf have also won the affection of locals, giving rise to notable athletes like Umran Malik and Ikra Rasool. Sheetal Devi from Kashmir captured the world's attention for being the first, the only woman international para archery champion without upper limbs. It's time now to celebrate the champions from this enchanting land as they display their passion for sports in this episode of Fit India Quiz. Four outstanding teams have joined us today for the second semi-final of Jammu and Kashmir. Two teams from here will make it to the main final. But to find out who those two teams are, we first need to know the four teams competing today. On team number one, we have Laksh and Lovish from HSS Ramgar. Welcome to the two of you. On team number two, we have Arshia and Harshit from Jammu Sanskriti School. Welcome to the two of you. On team number three, we have Rashi and Janvi from GGM HSS. Welcome to the two of you. On team number four, we have Hadi and Naushit from Jawahar Navodaya Vidyalaya. Welcome to the two of you. All right, we've seen the teams three rounds here to decide which two teams from here make it to the main final of Jammu and Kashmir. Let's get started with the first round of the quiz called Get Set Go coming up on your screen now. It's time for the first round of the quiz. Get Set Go. In this round, each team starting with team 1 will have an opportunity to select a topic of their choice. Remember, once a team has chosen a topic, it becomes unavailable to the other teams. After selecting your topic, a question will be displayed on the screen without any options. You can answer directly and earn 20 points. However, if you are uncertain about the answer, there is no need to worry. You can opt to view the options. Once the options are revealed, you will have three opportunities to choose the correct answer. If you guess it correctly on the first try, you will score an impressive 15 points. On the second attempt, you will earn 10 points and on the final try, you will receive 5 points. You will have 25 seconds to answer a question, whether or not you choose to view the options. There are no negative marks in this round and questions will not be passed to the other teams. This gives everyone a fair chance to excel. Let's get started and all the best. Six topics on your screen. The first team to pick the topic today is HSS Ramgar. HSS Ramgar, what would you like to choose today? Sir, Kelo India. Sir, Kelo India. Kelo India. Here's a question on Kelo India coming up on your screen now. Which actor, part of the Three Idiots cast, is the father of swimming sensation and multiple times Kelo India Youth Games gold medalist Vedant? Your timer has started. 25 seconds on the clock. If you need options, I can give you options. Options. Options on your screen. Sharman Joshi, R. Madhavan, Omi Vaidya or Amir Khan. Quickly, your first pick. Uh, R. Madhavan. Are you sure? Yes, sir. R. Madhavan. Confident. 
Brilliant HSS Stramga, that's absolutely right. This is our mother and in fact, who's the father of Vedant. That gets you a plus 15. You're off the block right away. Very good answer. This is in fact R Madhavan. And with that, we go back to the picture board. Question number two to team number two, which is Jammu Sanskriti School. Jammu Sanskriti School, five options on your screen. What's your pick? Sports venues. Sports venues. Here's a question on sports venues coming up on your screen now. Which marine creature inspired the design of the David S. Ingall skating rink built in 1958 and affectionately named the Yale Dash? Look at the picture. If you need options, I can give you options. Sir, options. Options on your screen quickly. Whale, shark, dolphin or squid? 10 seconds of time left. Whale. Sure? Yes, sir. Not shark? No, sir. Brilliant! Plus 15 to you, Jammu Sanskriti School. This is, in fact, the ale whale. That gets you a plus 15. Very good answer, Jammu Sanskriti. With that, we go back to the picture board. Question number 3 to GGM HSS. GGM HSS, four topics on your screen. What's your pick? Healthy diet. Healthy diet. Here's a question on healthy diet coming up on your screen now. Which is the primary macronutrient found in avocados? If you want options, I can give you options. Your timer has started. Options. Options on your screen. Proteins, fats, fibers or vitamins. Ten seconds left quickly. Five proteins. seconds quickly. No, not proteins quickly. Next option. Proteins. Okay, I said it is not proteins, and I was waiting for your other uh, guest, DG MHS. Unfortunately, your timer has run out. The answer I was looking for was fats. Okay, that's the answer I was looking for. But not a problem, GGM HS is two more rounds to go and a lot of points at stake. With that, we go back to the picture board. Question number four to team number four, which is JNB Bandipur. JNB Bandipur, three options on your screen. What's your pick? What supports? What the sports? Here's a question on what the sports coming up on your screen now. Which modern day water sport was called Hia Nalu or wave sliding by the ancient Hawaiians? If you want options, I can give you options. Your timer has started. Options. Options on your screen. Roving, flyboat, surfing, or wakeboarding? Wave sliding. 10 seconds left. Flyboard. No, not flyboard. Next option quickly. Wave body. Uh, another option quickly. And rowing. Unfortunately, okay, rowing is also not right. You have lost your time, JNB Bandipur. The answer that I was looking for was surfing, okay? Because you slide through waves. That's why we said wave sliding. But not a problem, JNB Bandipur. Two more rounds to go and a lot of points to be scored. With that, we come to the end of round number one. And here's how the scorecard looks. HS Ramkar are at 15. Jammu Sanskriti School are at 15. GGM HSS have not opened their account. And JNB Bandipur have not opened their account. Two more rounds to decide which two teams from here make it to the Jammu final. And with that, let's get to the second round of the quiz. It's called the second lap coming up on your screen now. Welcome to the second lap. In this round, teams will pick their topics in reverse order, starting with the last team. Each question in this round will feature six images, out of which only four are correct. For every correct selection, your team will earn five points. However, be cautious. If you choose an incorrect option, your score for that question will reset to zero, and your turn will end there. If a team manages to select all four correct images, they will receive a bonus of five points. So when in doubt, it might be wiser to stop and secure the points you have. There is no passing of questions in this round. 
Each question comes with a maximum time limit of 45 seconds. So you need to be both quick and accurate. Good luck. Six topics on your screen. We'll go counterclockwise starting from GNV Bandipur in this round. GNV Bandipur, six topics. What's your pick? Athletics. Athletics. Here's a question on athletics coming up on your screen now. List of field events for men in which the world record created by a player is less than 20 meters. Your timer has started. Start giving me the events. Twenty-five seconds left, guys. Quickly. Triple jump. Seconds left. Triple jump. That's plus five. Sorry. Whole what? That's another plus five. Two more seconds left. Hammer through. Okay. Uh, unfortunately, you've lost time, uh, JNB Bandipura. So uh, you actually said hammer throw after your time ended. Fortunately for you, hammer throw was an incorrect answer. Okay. But since you told that after the timer had ended, we won't take that into account, which means JNB Bandipura, you get yourself plus 10. Very good answer, JNB Bandipura. The four options that we were looking for were triple jump, high jump, long jump and pole vault. Those are the four options that we were looking for as the right answers in that list. With that, we go back to the picture board. Question to GGM HSS. GGM HSS, five options on your screen. What's your pick? World Cup. World Cup for GGM HSS coming up on your screen now. List of FIFA World Cup Golden Boot winners. Start giving me the sequence. Your time has already started. Please unmute. Unmute, guys. You're on mute. Yeah. Quickly, quickly. Uh, GGMHSS. You only have 15 more seconds left. Kylian Mbappe. Yeah, Kylian Mbappe. That's right. Next one. Harry Kane. Harry Kane is right. Four more seconds. Quickly. Your time has ended. GG uh, Hamech is Samba. Kylian Mbappe, Harry Kane is absolutely right. You get plus 10. But what was your third and fourth guess in case if your timer had not ended? GG Hamech is Samba. Sir, what are you In case if the timer hadn't ended, what would you have guessed? Lionel Messi. Thankfully, your timer ended. GG MHS is Samba. Lionel Messi is not the right answer. Okay. Thankfully, your timer ended. Today, the time has saved both JNB and GG MHS is Samba. So, both of them lost their time and guessed the wrong answer after the timer ended. The right sequence here is James Rodriguez, Kylian Mbappe, Miroslav Klose, and Harry Kane. Lionel Messi and Cristiano Ronaldo have never won Golden Boot in a World Cup. Okay, but very good answer. Plus 10 to you, GTMHSS. Hey there, are you guessing the answers correctly but missing out on the rewards? Here is your 12th man chance. All you need to do is open the Fit India official Instagram page and check for the first clue in the stories. Then wait for the second clue, which will be shown on your screen in the next few seconds along with a question. Your job is to call on this number and give the answer within 5 minutes and stand a chance to win exciting prizes. Here is your second clue.
question number three to Jammu Sanskriti School. Jammu Sanskriti School, you've got four options on your screen. What's your pick? Sports and entertainment. Sports and entertainment. Here's a question on sports and entertainment on your screen now. List the biopics amongst these movies based on cricket. Start answering, guys. MS Dhoni. That's a plus five. Iqbal. Iqbal is a very good guess, Jammu Sanskriti school, but Iqbal is not a biopic. It is based on cricket, but it is not a biopic, which means you lose the sequence and you don't score any points in this round. But don't worry, Jammu Sanskriti school, one more round to go and a lot of points to be scored in that round. The four answers that I was looking for were MS Dhoni, The Untold Story, Chakda Express, Shabash Meetu and Azar. Okay, those are the four options that I was looking for. Back to the picture board to one last question in this round and that is to HSS Ramgar. HSS Ramgar, three options on your screen. What's your pick? That's surprise. Surprise. Here's a surprise question for you on your screen. List the correct nicknames of the respective national cricket teams. Your timer has started. Start giving me the answers. AUS Australia. I'm sorry? Emus Australia is your first guess? Yeah, Emus Australia is not the right answer. This is Ramgas Australian team are not called Emus. But that's not a problem. Like I said, there's one more round and a lot of points to be scored in that round. Here's the right answer for you. This is Lions Sri Lanka, Protea South Africa, Chevron Zimbabwe and Kiwis New Zealand. Okay. Two rounds done here. The scorecard still looks very tight. It's anybody's game at this point of time. Like I said, two teams from here make it to the main final of Jammu and Kashmir. HSS Ramkar are at 15, Jammu Sanskriti School are at 15, GGM HSS are at 10 and JNV Bandipur are at 10. With that, we go to the final phase of the quiz, the buzzer round coming up on your screen now. In Do or Die, we introduce buzzer questions. When you buzz in, you have two choices. Play it safe to earn 10 points or risk losing 10 points, or take a risk to double the points, potentially earning 20 points or risking a loss of 20 points. If the first team to buzz in answers incorrectly, the question will be passed on to the next team on the buzzer. Before providing your answer, ensure you declare whether you are playing for the default points or opting for double points. This round can significantly impact your score, so be quick, smart and confident. Five questions to decide which of these two teams make it to the main final of Jammu and Kashmir. The questions are ready, the participants are ready and the buzzers are ready as well. Five questions one by one. The first question coming up on your screen, hands on the buzzer. Question coming up now. Which Kriya is a salutation to a component of nature incorporating 12 asanas to enhance flexibility throughout the body? 12 asanas to enhance flexibility, a component of nature. JNV Bandipura on the buzzer. JNV Bandipura, please unmute. What's your answer? Default or double? No option. No options, JNV Bandipura. You'll have to give me an answer. Sir, double. Okay, what's your answer? Surya Namaskar. Brilliant! Plus 20 JNV Bandipura. That's absolutely right. This is Surya Namaskar. The 12 asanas and of course Ode to Nature. And that would lead you to Surya Namaskar. Which means JNV Bandipur have scored a very crucial plus 20 at this point. And with that we go to question number 2. Hands on the buzzer. Question number 2 coming up on your screen now. Which sport responsible for producing the first Indian female Olympic medalist is governed by the organization represented by this logo? Uh, Jammu Sanskriti school have gone on the buzzer default or double Jammu Sanskriti? Sir, default. Default and what's your answer? Wrestling. Wrestling is a very good guess Jammu Sanskriti school. It is not wrestling that gets you a minus 10. 
All right, no team has gone on the buzzer. Jammu Sanskriti school came very close. It wasn't wrestling though. The answer that I was looking for was weight lifting by Karnam Malleshwari. That's the answer I was looking for. Three more questions to go. Hands on the buzzer. The scorecard still looks tight. Jammu Sanskriti, one good answer and you will be back to the top. Okay, so don't worry about that. Question number three, hands on the buzzer. Question coming up on your screen now. Which legend of Indian sports with multiple Olympic medals to his credit is being interviewed in this video? The video will play just right away. Video, please. And for our Lucknow Doodarshan Kendra, for this work, today the thing is that we are in our studio. 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 All right, here's the question. Which legend of Indian sports with multiple Olympic medals to his credit is being interviewed in this video? Jammu Sanskriti school have gone on the buzzer. Double or default, Jammu Sanskriti? Double. Okay, and what's your answer? Major Dhyanchan. Brilliant! Plus 20, Jammu Sanskriti school. What did I just say with the previous question? I said Jammu Sanskriti. One good answer and you'll be back on top. And they have done exactly that. They got a minus 10, but they came back with a plus 20. Very good answer, Jammu Sanskriti School. This is, in fact, Dhyanchan. And a little trivia, though, we are shooting from the major Dhyanchan National Stadium, which, of course, you do see in the background. All right, two questions to go. The quiz is getting very tight. Remember, once again, two teams from here make it to the next level. Okay, keep that in mind. Hands on the buzzer. Question number four coming up on your screen now. Considered illegal in most combat sports, which punch eponymous with a herbivore was named after a technique used by hunters to catch that animal? All right, HSS Ramgar on the buzzer. HSS, what's your answer? Please unmute. Is it a double or a default? Uh, HSS Ramgar, you're on mute. Please unmute. Yes, what's your answer? Sir, default. Default, what's your answer? Sir, poaching. Poaching is a very good guess, HSS Ramgar, but unfortunately, that is not the right answer and the timer has passed too, which means I can't take the question to the other teams. The answer that I was looking for was rabbit punch, okay? All right, that's a bad time to take a minus 10. But don't worry, HSS Ramgar, if you do get 25, of course, you could still come back into the game. Hands on the buzzer. Here's the final question of the semi-final two coming up on your screen now. Which legendary tennis player is the first living Swiss to have a coin minted in his honor? Swiss player. Legendary Swiss player. Five seconds remaining. HSS Ramgar on the buzzer. Double or default HSS Ramgar. Roger Federer. On... Roger Federer and you did not say double. You just said Roger Federer. I told you in case you don't say double and you give me an answer right away, you will only get 10 points. Why would you just say Roger Federer HSS Ramgar when you really needed a double to get back into the game? Well, we are learning that a lot in Fit India Quiz. All the teams they are very tense and unfortunately they miss out the very very small details and that is what HSS Ramgar has also done today. The answer was in fact Roger Federer but let's see how that extra 10 points would have been crucial for them. HSS Ramgar are at 15, Jammu Sanskriti school are at 25, GGM HSS are at 10, JNB Bandipur are at 30. If HSS Ramgar had gone for a double, they would have tied for the second position. But unfortunately, HSS Ramgar, out of excitement, I can understand, of course, you know, when you are fighting to finish, sometimes you do miss out those small details. And they just said Roger Federer. And unfortunately, I only had to give them plus 10. 
But what an exciting semi-final we've had today. Two teams, JNB Pandipur and Jammu Sanskriti School, make it to the next round of the quest. Remember here, Jammu Sanskriti School at one point of time almost lost the game, but they came fighting back and now are on the top. Well, a lot of excitement still awaits in all the other episodes of Fit India Quiz. Stay tuned, watch them. Till then, this is your host Surya signing off. Stay fit, stay healthy. Jai Hind.